you know, ginger is one of my favorites. And I think the, the thing, the nice thing with herbs is usually they're not just like one for one. You can often use the same herb for so many different things. So I think, you know, in, the, in that sense, um, herbs are so powerful and they can help um, overall functioning of our not just our health but also targeted functioning for gut health so ginger like I mentioned you know it's a powerful anti-inflammatory but it's also uh, really good for just gut health it helps with our digestion um, carminative so things like fennel things uh, like soft we might call it but fennel seeds are also equally good um, for digestion purposes and then we're trying to decrease inflammation, which most of us are all the time, um, turmeric is super helpful too, um, to just tone down the inflammation in the body. So the gut is also, you know, a source of great, a uh, great source of inflammation and that will help with gut health as well. I, I personally use it um, often too. I've, I've kind of grown up using it on and off. Mm -hmm. um, and you know, when we're talking about Ayurveda, we're talking about the dry, like the three doshic balance. Mm -hmm. So um, it, I think it's it's wonderful um, to just use every day. It's not it's not too strong, but it will really help. You'll you'll notice that difference in your in your gut health. It's it's helpful to bind loose stool if that's your issue and it also helps to kind of break it down if you're constipated so i think it really has that balancing effect